Number three, keep your software up to date. So again, I'm sure many of you are going to receive this alert in the bottom right of your screen that will tell you, you need to reboot your computer. And you know, you're in a meeting, oh, I will do it later and I will do it later. So you postpone, you postpone. And you know, you have an example of a credit uh, score, credit monitoring company in 2017. I will not say the name, but I think you all, you all know them. You know, they got 150 million records stolen. And the reason they were stolen is they had the OS update that uh, they postponed to do by two months. And, you know, when Microsoft or Apple or Google with Android, when they do an update, they do an update because, you know, either to make the product better or to block issues. And when issues are found, they are very often known into the world of hackers and they already step by steps of how to hack it. So you have an unpatched OS, hacker can just come into your OS and you know do damage. So again, never, I will say, postpone updates, just do updates. So again, I will ask you for on your system, is your OS always up to date? Yes or no? How do you manage company OS updates? And as you may have seen, Microsoft pushed an update about two, two weeks ago, Apple, for the iPhone, push a mandatory update three weeks ago. So how do you manage it in your company? Just to give you an example with uh, the customer we manage, we receive a notification from uh, Microsoft, Apple, and Google. And within the hour that we receive notification, we force the update of all our uh, clients' machines, all the ones that we manage. And within 24 hours, all their systems have been patched, done.